Uh, welcome once again to Living in the 21st Century. Joining me today is Rupert Berman. He's from Austria, a baritone, rich in history. <laughs> Rupert, it's like almost six years. We haven't spoke um, in our last, since our last interview. It's really a pleasure to have you on today. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Errol, sure. for the invitation to this interview. And it's exactly six years, actually. <laughs> <laughs> well, look at that. <laughs> look at that. That's beautiful. <laughs> so, so, Rupert, just for those who don't know who you are, could you basically like, explain a little bit about yourself? Oh, okay. Well, I am at the moment sitting here in Austria in late afternoon, and I am an opera singer. I have been working as an opera singer for over 30 years. And I did a lot of stuff like operetta and contemporary music. And at the moment, I am a little on my way to retire and to focus more on spirituality, Christian, Franciscan spirituality. So it's, it, it is exciting and uh, I still uh, do my project as an, as an artist, uh, focusing both on music and on, on religion. And maybe we talk a little about that in the... In well, the that is interesting. <laughs> yeah. Religion and arts, well, that's beautiful. Yeah, 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 yeah. Actually, the religion was always a very important part of music history, you know, uh, for over... 2000 years, even before in Jewish times, the, the music was very important, you know, and they, they had the trumpets, you know, we, yes. we, we talk about in the Psalms and, and so on. So up to the day, this is this is an important part of, of, of religious belief, at least of the Judeo-Christian uh, religious beliefs, you know. So, but uh, maybe uh, to, to be a, to to say a little more about on my biography, I, I was born in Graz, which, which is a second largest city in Austria. And I went to, there to high school and studied there at the University of Music Academy. And then moved to, to, to the greater Vienna area about, yeah, you know, almost 30 years ago and have been living here ever since and, and do uh, Worked with several companies. I toured also around Europe, and and that's how we met. Um, I, I, I went, went uh, a couple of times, or actually often, to the to the east coast of the United States because my sister. I have I have four siblings, and my sister is living in uh, near Boston, and she's also a, a musician. <laughs> And on, on, on one of my visits, I had, a, I had a project with an Ukrainian singer and we, together with the singer, Olga Lisovska, we met you at, at, at the studio and had an interview yeah. with her at, TV, at Newton TV. And uh, yeah, at a part of that, uh, speaking of, of Ukrainian or the Ukraine, one of my major focuses was also uh, going to the Ukraine on a regular basis uh, to, 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 to be a part of festivals, mm -hmm. mostly in Odessa. Actually, I went in 1997 uh, for, the first time, for the first time to Odessa for a festival of contemporary music and, and made my contacts there. And from there on, uh, yeah, I, I almost went there on a regular basis until mm -hmm. this year, actually, after the war, and maybe I, 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 will, I will go later this year, despite the, the situation. So this was one of my other focuses, uh, several, several festivals in Austria. And, yeah. and, and now, of course, I do a lot of church music. I, I sing at church every, every Sunday, or play the organ, or be the lector, or what I, 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 I to, to be clear, I'm Roman Catholic. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> That's good. That's great. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> uh, 
uh, one one should say, should say that for the foreign audience in in in, in the United States. Well, here Massachusetts is basically a Catholic oriented state, <laughs> so that's yeah. pretty fine. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, 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 yeah. That, 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 that's, that, one, that's one thing you would have mentioned, though, I want to ask you about. You mentioned Croatia, Austria, and Ukraine. There are some similarity in cultural music. Well. Um, it, Actually, Ukrainian art is more oriented to the East. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, maybe if, if if you say it, it, it is it's it's it's, it's the, the world of Russian culture. You cannot. This is not really, really accurate to say, but but uh, but uh, but uh, but but it's it's different from 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 our uh, music tradition yes. actually a little. I mean, of of course, we are we are related, and 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 there there was a, a lot of cultural influence from from Western Ukraine. You know, uh, Lviv, where I have been last October for this festival, Lviv Lemberg in German uh, uh, was a very important city of of the Austrian Hungarian. Uh, uh, Em, emperor uh, and and uh, and uh, so so there over the last few hundreds of years there there were many relations cultural relations political and so on relations so you you cannot really say it is it is the same but 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 you 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 also cannot say it's totally different you know we are, we are we are so close actually in 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 yes. To compare it with the United States or, or with other continents, Africa. So, uh, we are this sense is so so far, but but it is, for example, from here, from Vienna, to 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 to, to the Ukrainian border, it's about five hundred kilo kilometers or so, and 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 to Odessa, it's only a thousand thousand. It is it is closer to go to it, Odessa is closer than Paris, you know, uh -huh. no, or it is the same distance than Rome. So we we are very 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 related yeah i would I, I would say that hmm? it's, it's the same but as with croatia even closer <laughs> <laughs> let me ask you this question with a displaced ukrainian um traumatized culture right now as it stands do you see the war has any um future negative effects on how the arts are being looked at at this mm. present moment. Uh, uh, would you I have the same kind mm. of feel for music like it was before? Well, uh, of, of course it, it impacts, it, it, it has an impact. Uh, it, it has an impact uh, above all on the, on, the, on the artists, you know, on the artists yeah. living in Ukraine. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I'm, I'm thinking of my friends in, in Odessa. Mm -hmm. um, of 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 who uh, some the female ones they em they, they 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 left the country you know the young female female yes. ones with, with, with their children they they left the the the, the, the country the the, the 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 young males they can they are not allowed because they have to stay mm -hmm. by law right. they are forced to to stay because maybe they were they are drafted into the in, into the army ones. Yes. Uh, and the elder ones, they say, or at least my friends say, we do not leave. It is our country. We stay, even if the circumstances are are bad, uh, and or or e even the the, the, the life uh, gets worse and worse. Mm -hmm. uh, but it is our country, and 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 uh, it, there will be better times also one one mm -hmm. one good one day. You no, know? no, so. Uh, and this is one one thing I, I, I would say. I mean, uh, as I told you, I, I have been uh, to this festival in 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 Lviv last October, and I probably will go later this year to another festival. I had the impression being there that the people really want to want to keep on with their daily life despite the situation, you know, and and. And and when I was there, there in, in October, it was a lot of thing, a lot of people outside. It was nice weather, sitting in in the cafeteria, you know, on the main square. So it, it was almost normal. You 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 could and, and you had the feeling they want to have this. They they don't want to to get to to, to get uh, 
this this destructive mindset you know right. so so i i i i think and the, the impact well you 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 on on the, on the long term you really cannot say i mean if 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 this conflict carries on and more and more people emigrate from more and more people and more and more artists uh, leave the country maybe it is a loss but 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 still yeah. The, the big cultural uh, uh, institutions they seem to work you know yeah. the opera houses they have their their regular performances i i, I see on facebook they're they're, con they're they're all the time posting pictures of their productions and and and, and so on so so maybe it, it is not so 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 extreme the effect on it on uh, speaking right. on because um, right. i was basically examining the origin of the music as it exported as people migrate from ukraine into other countries they're going to carry that same flavor of music with them sure but as those who for those who stay back and mm. become traumatized i think the perception and how they um see things may change it may may mentally alter the way of how um it affects the flavor of music, how, how it used to be seen out of an yeah. original eye before. It may now be different. I don't know. Yeah. I think... No. <laughs> mm -hmm. I, I, I definitely think that that that, uh, that the situation uh, reflects in, 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 in the artwork, in the music, in, in that what I, I'm speaking of contemporary, more contemporary right. music of, of creators who, who, who write their music. And I, I, I have a... An, a, a some somehow strange um strange episode because to, to tell in in in, in this in, in this uh, respect uh, uh eight years or now nine years ago when 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 this conflict started with 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 uh, with with uh, maidan and the crim situation um uh, I was I was in i went to odessa and and before that a composer female composer um uh who had had written to, to, totally crazy atonal stuff then she wrote a new piece and this was more soft and tonal and 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 uh nice to listen to <laughs> i say yes. and i asked her why why do you suddenly change your writing and she said well the situation around is so crazy with this uh, this uh, this uh, crime situation and so on. Yes. That we better have, I, I paraphrase, nice music, mm -hmm. or good music for 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 the soul. I, I no, you you know. So yes. so so yeah. there is definitely a, a, a reflection on on the situation by the by the by the art, uh, artists and 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 I, I know it also from the very young ones. They 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 try also to to some reflected and some totally escape you know I, I, they don't, totally don't want to 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 uh, confront themselves with with, with these things so I, I i think there is a var variety of of reactions on this situation hmm? uh, absolutely yes because i'm one of those who firmly believe that the expression of music centers around your both your psychological and your inner emotions and how it is yeah, being yeah. produced to a community that yeah, somewhat builds yeah, the, the fabric yeah, of yeah, yeah. that music. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I want to yeah. look at it um, from the standpoint, you know, in the church, the church, the philosophical view of religious, religion and music, because as you said earlier that religion and music always work coincide with each other. And mm -hmm. I found that in our modern day religion, um, even though people go and worship and sing worship songs, it don't, you can't feel or see the sacredness surrounding that music. Uh, it's just like the secular music. And I think mm. when you're going to worship and give religious um, mm. meanings to sound, that you should be able to feel the presence of the Holy Spirit in that. There should be some kind of sacredness in it. And there's a mm. wide deviation from that. What's your perception on that? Yes, uh, uh, exactly. I, 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 I think that uh, 
there is a lot of music, but not all of it is uh, fits within the religious religious context, and 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 uh, maybe there, there are a couple of of, of, of things things to say. Uh, of course, liturgy comes from the spoken word, you know, yeah. logos, logos, uh, John, one, right, mm-hmm. and 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 if if you come from there, of course, the 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 the, the, the music has to, I, I don't say it has to serve, but has to go along with the word, yeah, so so uh, that that. That's the, the first point. But what music can do is to give the word uh, a new and additional world, world, you know, and, and a, a, a new, uh, yeah, a new realm and a new uh, area. Yeah, it, it elevates the word. Right? It has the potential to elevate the word, and 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 I think that could be the criteria. That, the, that this is the music for worship, for liturgy, that is able to do that. Mm-hmm. And other and uh, other music, which which is all, all, all always, uh, which is, you, you, you also can can say maybe you can say uh, uh, a, a modern kind of music uh, like rock or, or or pop music. Maybe it's not so fitting because because it is it, 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 it does not allow to to enter to to to, uh, to elevate the word so much. I mean, uh, why, why I say that? Because I have uh, I, I recently I, I read a, a book by by the late Pope Benedict the Sixteenth mm-hmm. um, or Josef Ratzinger, who was very fond of music and who who reflected a lot on this. Uh, on, 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 on the relation between liturgy and music and 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 he he clearly s- says that that, that, that that music can elevate the word so it, it is not on, on, on my own, <laughs> my my own idea and and he he's, he says also this 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 long church music tra- tradition uh, that that we have be it the the, the Gregorian chant I don't know if you said it in English like that from from the from the Middle Ages or or or, or the or, or later the, the polyphonic uh, masses and, and 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 later Mozart and Bach and 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 Bruckner and so on. Uh, all 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 these all the, all all that is there is not not also a contemporary music with which can that there are very nice nice songs. One one I I was. Uh, I, I, I was uh, not really contemporary, but but it is it is nineteenth century from, by by Philip Bliss. Uh, it is well with my soul. It's a wonderful song, beautiful which, song, we, which very much elevates, I think, the the, the, the word. And there is for sure uh, 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 songs of the of the twenty twenty first, even twenty first century, who, who are able to do that. Uh, but as a church musician, you 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 maybe should always. Have this in mind. The word is important. Is is important to elevate the word with the music. I think. So I mean, what is your what is your take on that? <laughs> yeah. Well, 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 one thing I hope and believe in that the universities and colleges that teach the performing arts maintain the foundation of traditional music. Um, I think it's it has establishes the foundation for other art forms, other forms of music. And when I look around today, the generation is actually breaking away from the old traditional form of music to some extent. Um, But I often wonder what would be the economic benefactors for those who maintain the old structured art form. Would it go away in the next two generations from now, or would it be consistently preserved through colleges and universities? Mm. What, what, what do you think? Uh, I, I, un- unfortunately, the, 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 the audio was a little interrupted. Oh, the audio was bad. Repeat the question. Yeah, I'll, I'll repeat yeah. it, yes. So I, I, was, I was stating that 
where the universities and college consistently maintain the old foundation of music because mm. if you want to look at the economic benefactors in it, uh, mm. it doesn't matter how music is being deviated from mm. the foundation of music in its sense, it still needs that old traditional art form. The, the lyrics, the, the, the psychology of it, everything I believe is embodied within that old music art form from whence it really mm -hmm. came. What, what you think is a vision in colleges, I don't know if you may know this question, um, when it comes to the old art form, will they consistently preserve it and teach it as the basic oh, to all it's generations? It's again interrupted, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Okay, well, let me show, let me summarize. Okay, I don't, I can't hear you anymore. Okay. Oh, you can hear me? Mm. Hello? Hey, can you hear me? Yeah, now, now it's again, yeah, the, the right. internet. Okay. Yes, the internet, yes. Um, so let me summarize it shortly. Yeah. Will colleges and universities maintain the foundation in music of the old traditional style of music? Mm. Yeah, I I think it is it is very important uh, to as a musician to have this uh, this traditional found uh, this, this this foundation of traditional music. I mean, I mean, even if you do a, a, a very uh, contemporary pop style music or, or or that what 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 you do maybe in evangelical uh, context. Uh, uh, even if you you do that, you, it is very good to have this classical foundation. I, I mean, not only uh, the, the technique, how to play an instrument or, or, or how to sing, but but also the, the, the mindset where where it, where it came from, you know. And and so I I I, yeah, I, I can uh, really encourage uh, young musicians to uh, to get somewhere. Not necessarily on on, on, on on an academy, but there there, there, there might be very good uh, private teachers who 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 can who can pass that on if they have got them by themselves, you know. Uh, but 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 get it, get get, get yeah. this foundation uh, of harmony of, of even the, the knowledge about the composers, you know. Uh, you you don't need to 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 listen to to each each uh, mass or each church song by Mozart or Bach or so on, but 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 get to know these things and try to do them by to do uh, them by yourself. I mean, I I I, I, I do uh, church music on a regular basis, on uh, two two times a week, one time on Sunday, one one time on Thursday morning mass. And, and and often I, I, I try to, 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 to sing a solo, to sing a song or, or, or a little or a little aria what, what what comes out of a of, of a church music uh, a piece so or what is part of a church music so try to 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 to, to incorporate this this this, uh, this 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 traditional repertoire into your own absolutely uh, in, into your own individual uh church music uh, uh acting so to say <laughs> yes, absolutely do you think classical and opera would be a lot around for a long time uh, considering now in this new generation well <laughs> classical <laughs> opera is a it is as it is it, as you yeah. say classically it is it is yeah, it, it is and preserved. And it is preserved yeah. among a lot of young people in schools and colleges. Yeah, um, yeah. I, 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 yeah. I, I, I encourage also to teach this mm -hmm. this style, uh, this mm -hmm. this this kind of of of, of art. Uh, of course, it it, it is more uh, more from the past than from the from 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 our times yes. but still there there are there are a lot of contemporary composers who write nice pieces yes. like like i i, I tried to, uh, to to ask young composers to write for me like i had asked this 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 put to write about this piece about job or the or, or about paul but uh but the problem today is uh that uh um that that 
opera always uh, wants to, needs to have a, a, a staging and needs to have an, an, a presentation and 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 for for a couple of decades the presentations speaking of of the sets and 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 of the and so on uh, tends to be very modern, meaning that yes. that yes. That, uh, that that the stage directors try to to, uh, to 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 communicate more their their own interpretation than the intentions of the creators of the pieces. And this is this is this is a a, a problem that that I personally really uh, see as, as as very grave. Um, because uh, there are many, especially, especially young stage directors, who should try to twist and turn around the pieces and 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 tell stories that are not in, but that would fit in their in in their personal uh, ideological narrative or whatever, you know. Yes. So, so I'm I'm not very uh, very. Uh, uh, happy with with this de 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 development. Still, I would recommend you can go to to the website of the Metropolitan Opera New York, for example. They 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 broadcast their 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 productions, and they sometimes have very nice, even a little old fashioned things, uh, or 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 maybe also other other producers who respect. And I think this is the important point who respect the intention of the writer and of the composer. Beautiful. Yeah. Well, Rupert, we have come to the end of yeah. this program. 30 minutes fly really oh. quickly. It goes yes. way fast. Yeah. <laughs> right. yeah. <laughs> but it was really a pleasure having you on and we will yeah, keep in touch. thank you. Definitely. And for all those who have been tuning in or living in the 21st century, I want to say to you, have a nice day. Mm -hmm.